Hey everyone, welcome back. So, we've we've been have we've been in a little bit of pickle. It, it, we've been we've been having a little trouble with uh, the Imperials, and uh, uh, this this guy right here hasn't uh, been on the up and up. So, let, let, let's see what's going on with all this trouble trouble that's been happening to us. A little bit of a little bit of a rock and a hard place with with friends and allies and enemies and everything. Stuff. And things. I, I know, right? Dot, dot, dot. Sir, may I come in? Reese, any results on that thing I asked you to look into? Uh-oh. Yes, sir. For starters, this bullet you gave me. Oh, that's the thing. We all know. We all know. Its shape and markings perfectly match rounds used by an experimental Gallian sniper rifle. Mm-hmm. Wait for it. So Alicia really was shot by someone inside the Gallian force. Oh, we all know who did so it. So any leads on who fired it? Oh, I know. I know. Tell me. Yes, I can tell you. It... Tell me, Kreese. The night before the shooting, records show Lieutenant Lanzett checked out the rifle. What? Faldio had the gun? Yeah, we knew Are that. Are you sure that's not some mistake? You could call it a snag in the fabric of friendship, or crumpled clothes of camaraderie, or you could it's say it's a just a crease. A sniper rifle. So the clerk remembered him. Sir, only two of those rifles exist right now. One is confirmed to be locked in the arsenal. Cool, that's a convenient plot point. The other was checked out to Lieutenant Lanzett and has yet to be returned. I can't. It's hard for me to believe, too. Faldio? It couldn't be. Oh, yeah, it could. Well, so far it's not telling us anything in particular. Let's uh, continue on with report. Parting ways? Truth. We seek the truth. Hey, Faldio, you in? Oh, here we go. Shit's gonna get really it's real. Not. Or not. So we're gonna snoop instead. Snoopity snoop. Notes on the Valkyrian race. The anthropology of the Valkyra. Oh god, they're trying to cliffhanger so bad. Up on the enemy. No! We... Hmm? This I is hate his it. handwriting. I hate it when they try to drag this out when we've all figured it out. It, it kills me. Alicia must be made to awaken. What? Oh my god, shocker. Must be made to awaken. No matter how much I try, I can think of no other way. We already know he didn't do it for malicious him on that expedition to the various ruins. <sighs> I'm convinced that the inner chamber was built to admit only Valkyra. But the door opened at her touch. That could only mean that the blood of their tribe courses through her veins. Still, I was shocked to find her bathed in that uncanny light that night in the field. Though I doubted my eyes, I never once doubted. That light was the Valkyrian blue flame. Oh my god, we know! Ultimately. I had no choice but to accept the simple truth that Alicia is one of them. I'd already begun to question all I knew. The walls of the temple sanctum were inscribed with the Valkyrie's account of history. History as it truly was. <sighs> we not surprised. We are all surprised. calamity and how their actions forever scorched the land. But this account told a different story. Oh, a twist. What could have the expected Valkyra that? The invaded this land from the north, slaying the indigenous Darkson people as they came. Their grasp of Ragnite technology and the art of war were vastly superior. Oh, here's going to be the quote-unquote surprise where the Darksons were actually the heroes, not the villains, because they we're all going to be surprised by that. Of Ragnite Jeez. on the Darksons' land, burned it to ash, then had the gall to pass the blame for their inhuman deeds off on their Darkson slaves. 
Darksons have borne that stigma ever since, while the Valkyrie became godlike saviors. The victors simply rewrote the history books. The Barius ruins promulgate a lie to all but their own descendants as hard fact. Reading about the Valkyrie's power, the true face of these saviors left me stunned. Uh huh. Yet at the same time, I cannot help but think of how useful it could be to us now. Since then, I've investigated every text and report on the Valkyrie I could find. They lead me to believe that at least a few scions of the Valkyrie must have survived to this day. All across Europa, these rare individuals live and die unaware of their own nature. But history has recorded rare cases of individuals who have awakened to their powers. Their stories share one common thread. All of them suffered grave wounds before awakening. Like a sniper bullet! Surprise! If those accounts are correct, the blood of the Valkyrie stirs at the approach of death. Their power, having slept for thousands of years, bursts awake at one step shy of the end. Once awakened, if one of these individuals takes hold of the refined ragnite arms of their ancestors, they make their mark on history as one of the Valkyrie of old. Ta-da! I couldn't stop myself. I stole the Valkyrian lance and shield out of the university archive. Supposedly their blood serves to amplify the ragnite's natural power. I have no idea what science lies behind it. Perhaps it's a consequence of their origins in the Ragnite-rich northern regions. Regardless of the reason, the Valkyria's life force itself calls forth a reaction from the stone. The enemy Valkyria decimated our forces on the Nagyar Plains. I could not afford to stay my hand on account of ethics. I had the rifle, and I forced myself to use it. I shot her. I place the lance and shield on her unconscious form. All written. Why? Why? Why would you write that? Here, here. I'm guilty. Ta-da. I was racked with insecurity and guilt. Hands red with blood of my best friend's love. But now I know. Yeah, I know. I'm pin pissing and money through this whole right. thing. Faldio! Come! Lieutenant Gunther. Is something wrong? But my name's Faldio. Faldio? Where is he? Sir, Captain Verrat just called him in. He left only a minute ago. <laughs> and not that this is going to be horribly predictable, but why, Faldio? Why did you do it? Because I had to. I had no choice. All right, let's let's get through this. Huff, 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 Faldio, huff. I'm only going to ask you this once. Was it you who shot Alicia? <laughs> no. Yeah. I shot her. <laughs> he even has the voice. <laughs> Bam! Tell me why. Why did you have to shoot her? The people. Galia needed her. Now let me ask you a question. How else do you think we could have won that battle? If not for Alicia's power, <laughs> Through lots of saving Galia and loading, as we saw. Lost. I still can't. And not just this battle. I'm talking about Galia's future. How else are we supposed to survive, Welkin? Caught on either side by giants. It's Alicia. Our Valkyria. She's the only one who can protect us from them. Wrong. Our side gaining power won't end this war. All it does is escalate the conflict. That's enough. There you go. It's waiting for her to step Listen in. Listen to each other. You may both be right. But still... You're both very wrong. I don't claim to have the perfect answer either. 
However, regardless of the reason, attacking one of your own comrades is deplorable. By Gallian military law, I remand you to the stockade until further notice, Faldio. And you, Welkin. I have no regrets. 24 hours in isolation for engaging in fisticuffs. <laughs> Forget Welkin's a badass sometime. Just, oh, engage some fisticuffs, some rabble rousing, some hoof for the hoof. Hoof, hoof for the hoof. I, that, okay, yeah, sure, that's a thing now. All right. Chapter 15, Citadel Girlendio. Yep. Okay. Let's now let's get back to the story that should be interesting. New weaponry, new glossary. Oh, new skirmish. Uh, we'll we'll get we'll get to that later. I'll I'll see how we how I do in this after story time. Well, one thing at a time. Story time first. Cutscene. Shh. Let's Thanks watch. to the victory at Nagyar, our forces have pushed the enemy back to the border. The Imperials are currently holed up in the Citadel at Girlandio. Girlandio? They make great chocolates. A crucial checkpoint along the commerce routes tying Gallia to the east since medieval times, the pass at Girlandio had been fortified for ages. The existing structure was rebuilt as a modern fortress during the First Europan War, and its grounds were littered with the casualties of war. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm, continue. Chop, chop. In the current war, it housed the Empire's command center, and now it stood as their final stronghold. Oh, is this it? This can't be it. What's our strategy for attacking the Citadel, Captain? Hmm. I still haven't received any details on our orders from above yet. Uh, that's not a bad thing. Oh, and here comes Dickhead. Yeah, oh, called stop it! stop your worrying, Verat. I came here myself to give you your orders. Yay. General Damon. I'm honored, <laughs> He's but General Damon. Your regiment really showed him up out there at Nagyar. In return, I'm granting you the honor of assaulting the Citadel at the van of the army. Sir? Here are your orders. There's a supply line running into the Citadel. We're sending a train car loaded down with explosives along it to blow us an entrance. Oh, this, this is going to go well. The track ahead of it. Flipping the right rail switches. Flipping rail switches, sir? <laughs> oh, this is gonna go well. This, while dodging a hailstorm of bullets? That sounds like a suicide mission, sir. <laughs> what are you talking about? It's the perfect challenge for your fearless crew. You're such a dick. If we succeed here, the Empire will finally be forced out of Gallia for good. You'll pave the way for the real army. You got that, Barat? Why? Why? Why are you still like, oh, our real armies can do shit when we've done everything and then some and then some more compared to all your dickheads? God, I, uh, 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 I'm General Damon. <sighs> Word. The, 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 those dots, dot, 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 just summed up. Everything Damn I was saying. It. Another mission they don't have the guts to do themselves. Right? Maybe. But it's a mission that somebody still needs to do. Precisely. As the general said, if we win, the Empire will be driven out of Gallia. Let this be our final battle. I'll await good news from the field. I'm so not buying that this is the end. But... We don't quite. We're not 100% sure. So let's uh, let's see what's happening on the other side. That look. That looks like the Emperor. It hurts. Mother, where are you? Hey, there's a survivor here. It's too late for the mother. Come on, we've got to get the child out now. Mother, where are you? Mother, mother. Sire, your grace.
<laughs> that incident grows old and stale. Silvaria, what news have you from the front? Sire, they seek to push our soldiers past the border, and the total of their forces approach those of our own. I see. The advantage now begins to sway towards the other side. It seems the loss at Nagyar has ended our hopes of strolling through the gates of Rondkreis. The fault lies with me. Yes. This would be over had I but won at Nagyar. Your grace, grant me another chance, I beg you. And it shall be your last. Please allow me to fight for your glory, sire. Dear Silvaria, <laughs> do you truly wish to be of help? Yes, more than anything. From the time you see He's trying to be a badass, but he just seems I've a little off. Known that I love you more than I do my own life. Of course. Sire, I want to work in the service of your dreams. Very well. And you shall have it. So, Silvaria, you report that the strength of our opponent now matches our own. In that case, let the fire of destruction rain down upon them. Use the final flame of the Valkyria. But... When I said I would die for you, I didn't mean as, like, just the general go-to. I, I was kind of hoping that I could do that. Your Not grace. ever. The hour of your death. Yeah. Will mark the inauguration of our rule. Farewell, Silvaria. <laughs> yeah, I kind of feel sorry for her. Ugh. Bo <laughs> Boobs. Can't say I'm impressed, Your Grace. Making a lady cry? Because you're awesome, Jaeger. This <laughs> is I am the awesome one of a number of scenarios we'd planned for since before Nagyar. If her prowess as a Valkyria is insufficient, Selvaria's uses quickly narrow to one alone. <laughs> anyway, there's a messenger here for you straight from Castle <laughs> All right, whatever, moving on. So there is. Let him wait. I have no time for simple messengers now. But, sir, it's important. We are set to commence Operation Steel Scythe. Jaeger, prepare to return back east. What? Then it's... the Marmota's finished? Didn't we already it whoop is. up on the Marmota? Word has come that it has completed its trial run. The Galleons are hasty to assume victory. We shall see them gutted yet. <laughs> dot dot dot. I'm sorry. Well, that was kind of a bummer. Yep, let's uh. No, we yeah, uh, okay. We already checked that out. Let's uh. Move on to the next episode. See what's uh. See what's uh going on here. With our troops. Yeah, that's our troops. Is everybody here? No. Still no Alicia, boss. I, I think she's right. resting. Well, let's start. A little, little bit of R&R &R for her. I already heard from another squad. We're prepping some tracks for a bomb. That's right. It's a rough one, but this is a critical mission. Ah, uh, this is the militia. We're used to getting all the bomb missions by now. <laughs> Word. With that settled, there's one question I gotta ask you, boss. Alicia's Valkyria powers and all. You plan to use those this time, too? Yeah, I'm gonna go stab her. Let her, let her loose. Well, no, not stab no, her like... Of course like, I don't. <laughs> but stab her like... Rah. I have faith in your natural abilities. Who needs Valkyra when I've got you all? Good answer. I'd expect no less from you, boss. We're ready for anything out there. After all, this could very well be it. I think they're just hinting that no, Alicia. Yeah, we're fine. 
You go be with Alicia, boss. She needs you real bad right now. So bad. All right. You all know what you're doing. But does he? This is a tough one. Even for nature boy. Having Alicia and the boss moping around is a drag for the whole squad. I hope for everyone's sake they can pull out of this funk real soon. Like in the next story scene. Yep, here we go. Alicia, there you are. What's up? Well, she seems relatively fine. Look at this, Welkin. Guess what? <laughs> I found some lion's paw growing while I was out on my walk. Yeah, she's rather chipper for this situation. Go. Very sharp. Makes you look like a real gentleman. Uh, well, thank you. Welkin. They said it was Valdio. Is it true? Afraid so. Then when I... When I walked through camp before, some of them got down on their knees, like they were worshipping me. Praise you the are Valkyria. pretty cute. The God Child. They... They were... begging me to save Galia. Me. No pressure. I mean, what am I supposed to say to that? <laughs> Alicia. Just Fonzie it. What Fonzie? Kind of life can, yeah, Fonzie it. Can I live from now on? Just look at him and go, hey. I wish I knew. <sighs> wow, I'm sorry. Guess that was pretty heavy. Here we are right before the last battle and I'm not helping things one little bit. Don't worry about me. <laughs> Alicia Melkiot, sir. Everything's fine. Reporting <laughs> and ready for duty. My mind is focused on the mission. See you later, boss. Alicia. You always know shit is heavy in animes when they just say their name. This looks like a battle. Here is your mission brief. I prefer mission boxers, thank you very much. Um, the enemy is braced and waiting for attack on the Citadel of Geraldio. They said it a bunch of times and I already forgot. Before we can storm the place, we need to pry off the lid. We'll blow... What? Oh, we'll blow in the front gates. I read that completely different. The plan as it stands is to, ro is to roll a car, but word stuff I can read, la la la, is to roll a cart down with explosives up to the gate and detonate it. Big a ba da boom. Your objective, oh my god, dear baby Jesus. Uh, your objective is to trip the three switches located along the rail. The switches locations are as you see here. You'll just have to push your way forward and hit each one in turn as you go. To activate each switch, approach it uh, in action mode and press the spacebar button. Nice and easy. Of course, what's going to possibly go wrong? They'll be bearing down on you with the Citadel cannons, among other things. I also advise you to watch for mines. It's time to put everything you've learned in your mission so far to work on kicking these imps out of Galia for good. Uh, yep. All three switches activated. That's... Oh, sweet. We don't even need to kill anyone. Good, good, good to know. Uh, Wilk dies, enemies occupies base camp, all allies and reserves are killed, or 20 turns pass. Alright, well, let's, uh... No! Yeah, unfulfilled. Let's, uh, position units. Alright. Okie dokie, so... What I have is my pretty, pretty standard group for the most part. I, of course, have all my people who give me CP, so I have Largo there, I have Alicia, I have... Uh, Rosie. Um, and I got a feeling that the cart's going to move relatively slow, but I definitely want to get there before the cart does to, to flip all the switches. So, 
I have two scouts who are just going to kind of run forward and kind of check things out. I got three, yes, three shock troopers. Two of them are pretty equipped for damage, but I threw in Edie just because she also has that uh, attack down weapon. So if I'm just getting people flying at me like crazy, we can hopefully we can hopefully at least mitigate the damage to some degree because I got a feeling that it's 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 gonna get a little hot and heavy. Um, of course, I need one engineer at all times, and I got me sniper. So hopefully this will work out relatively okay. Uh, one way to find out. Let's get started. I wish you good luck and happy hunting. And you know there's going to be shit barring our way. They're going to make this. There are switches total. Let's clear the yeah. way. Squad seven, move out. Uh, mm-hmm. So let, let's see what we got here. Foot soldiers, mortars, tanks. You oh, my. It, they'll be sending it all at us. Stay calm and just get from switch to switch. All right, soldiers, move out. All right. Well, we got Alicia. So she's our official little badass. Um, Enemy sighted. Enemy sighted. Uh, uh, that's not auspicious. Oh God! So they're they're all up in our grill. Well. That's a, that's a thing. Hmm. Okay. Yeah, we'll have Alicia sit there. Let's, let's just go ahead and get our tanks moving up there, like, now. So, little flamethrowy shamrock guy. Zaka, let's do this. His name is really close to Soka. Well, not really, but close, close enough for me. So, we'll just, uh... Yeah, we'll just kind of let him just move on forward and see see what this flamethrower can do. Because maybe I'll hit both of them. Maybe, maybe, possibly. Yes. No. But that, that oh, no, I did get him. Oh, he's dead. Nice. Uh, yeah, let's end it this turn. And now, let's start, let's start cleaning, cleaning some houses. Oh, and while your back is turned to me, I can appreciate this. Excuse me. And boop, 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 boop. Well, the, the first switch, of course, is going to be easy. I I have no reservations that this is going to suck major balls. So we'll end turn. Um, what do we have? Gatling gun. That's not a big deal. That's trooper early. Oh, God. What's this business up here? Um... Okay, well. Mm -hmm. And a tank. Okay. I think what I will do. Okay, I'm on top of it. Let's see how well this works out. So mines, yeah, there's fucking mines everywhere. Enemy sighted. Oh god damn it! Mm, not quite. Nope, 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 nope. So, Will, at least you're a scout, so come on, line that shot up. Boop! And a boop, and a, oh, a little present for you. Boop! Okay. Well, that's good. Um. Whoa, 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 whoa. So, that tank's gonna be a pain in the ass. Um. <laughs> oh, shit. Uh, do I want to try to swing Largo? Or no, let's just get him go straight down the middle. Use that tank for a little bit of cover. We're going to be sitting ducks right here. Let's see what we can do about getting our tank moving forward. Put, 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 put along. I see you, Rosie. Brace for their attack. 
Mm-hmm. This is at this point where our our whole objective is just to figure out what the fuck to do. Um, Vice, let's have him swing around. Because if Largo can't make it to that tank, I want Vice to be able to behind him. To, to use the technical term. Um, yeah, we'll just move everyone into the forwards. Because uh, at least Edie can sit behind the tank. Like so. Two more command points, two more people. Um, we will... You know what? Let's see if there's anybody to aim at. <laughs> Gatling bunkers. Uh, way out of range. You know what? I'll take it. I'll No, I'll fucking take that shit. All right. Because if I could pull that off a second time, we just probably took out something oh that uh, no, is in the category of bullshit. Because <laughs> snipers up there are going to fucking hurt my face. Just saying. The rest is up to you. Uh, yeah, no pressure. 